You probably heard about 3D printing. It is indeed a revolutionary invention. But as you all know, when Elon Musk comes to the scene, everything goes beyond our expectations. Continuing that trend, the tech titan Elon Musk introduced 4D printing as a new way to reach Mars. Want to know how? Then stay tuned till the very end. Hello, and welcome to Elon Musk Evolution. If you're a Musk fan and don't want to miss anything about this incredible person, then smack the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so that you will be notified whenever a new video is uploaded. In today's video, we are going to tell you how Elon Musk just revealed that 4D printing is our way to Mars. As Elon Musk is the CEO of the famous space technology company, SpaceX, he told us that even by his standards, it costs a lot of money to launch something into space. The price per pound goes from roughly $9,000 to more than $40,000. With such a high price tag, weight and space are at a premium on shuttle missions, prompting them to explore new and imaginative ways to manufacture smaller payloads. Elon says there's a lot we don't know about spaceflight and its effects on the human body over a three-year period, and while we'd want to prioritize remote health examinations, radio signals from Mars to Earth take 20 minutes to reach Earth, and vocal answers take at least twice as long. That implies a doctor or other healthcare expert would need to be on board and have access to a variety of resources in the event of an emergency. Once we get on Mars, we must address cosmic ray protection, how to alter the atmosphere, and how our bodies will react to the reduced gravity. We wouldn't have to front-load the spaceship with these resources since rover expeditions discovered raw materials that could be used to create colonies, but we'd still have to figure out how to build a town that isn't exposed to the sun's severe radiation. Elon also thinks about other troubles. There are several more issues, including a shortage of accessible water on the surface, mainly ice, a lack of breathing air, extremely low water pressure, and bitterly cold temperatures averaging minus 85 degrees Fahrenheit. The list of problems keep going on until Elon Musk comes in and tells us the solution. An experiment noticed by Mr. Musk did the magic. A team at Georgia Tech is testing a technology that employs 3D printers to manufacture little structures that expand when exposed to heat, which might help solve the problem in the future. The process is a type of 4D printing, in which a 3D printed structure changes shape after it is produced, as defined by the scientific community. Time is the fourth dimension here. It's become a bit of an industry term of late, but it's a good fit here. As we all know, 3D printing technology has been around for over 30 years. While the additive manufacturing industry continues to develop new applications, materials, and 3D printers, new technology is emerging. It's called 4D printing by the scientists, and it's right out of the future. And guess what? Elon Musk is extremely enthralled by the idea and is very cheered up to implement this technology in the next SpaceX operation. Musk himself admired the researchers behind this experiment, and he decided to introduce 4D printing as a way that can pave our path to colonizing Mars. The Georgia Tech team's work relies on temperature fluctuations to initiate the metamorphosis. The utilization of tensegrity, a technique in which floating solid highways are kept together by wires, is where the study stands out the most. Lightweight, sturdy, and quickly collapsible, the systems are excellent for space travel. Glaucio Polino, professor at Georgia Tech's School of Civil and Environmental Engineering, said regarding the experiment, Tensegrity structures are extremely lightweight, while also being very strong. The goal is to find a way to deploy a large object that initially takes up little space. Elon Musk then tried to explain further about the invention. And Elon has already implemented 3D printing in almost all of his ventures like SpaceX and Tesla. Thus, it is widely regarded as one of the most transformative technologies in the industry. It has fundamentally changed the way parts or components and equipment are made, as well as their design and development in the industry. Manufacturers like Elon Musk's Tesla and researchers can now create complicated forms and structures that were previously thought to be impossible to create using standard manufacturing processes. And over the previous three decades, 3D printing technology has progressed dramatically. But as we all know, Elon always thinks a step ahead of everyone, and is now showing support for the fairly new tech of 4D printing. For example, it's basically a tech to produce device or object that can be turned from a 1D strand into a pre-programmed 3D shape, or from a 2D surface into a pre-programmed 3D shape. And this capability of morphing between different dimensions is referred to as 4D printing. For example, heating, light, or swelling in a liquid 
can promote such transitions electrochemically, as can encoding varying sensitivity to, say, swelling into distinct regions of the planned shape. These approaches promise new possibilities for integrating programmability and easy decision-making into non-electronic-based materials, as well as adaptability and dynamic responsiveness for structures and systems of various sizes to get success in getting more payload to the Mars. And all these growing need for flexible products in a variety of applications, including self-folding packaging, adaptive wind turbines, and so on for the Mars mission, are going to be helped by the rise of 4D printing. As Elon Musk himself explained this, that one of the major issues with transporting things into orbit is the enormous amount of space required, as well as the weight and, of course, the expense. As a result, SpaceX and NASA and the space industry were frantically looking for fresh answers to this challenge. 4D printing might just be the answer that will help Elon to build compact payloads, making shipping easier and more efficient. Later, Musk explained all the basics and regulations that govern 4D printing, as well as the materials used in 4D printing and applications like soft robotics, as well as the hurdles that must be addressed for 4D printing to become a widespread manufacturing method. So as he explains, the group of Georgia Tech researchers developed a pair of small, unfurling structures that might have huge promise for space missions. So in creating the item, the researchers used tensegrity. Tensegrity is a structural system made up of floating rods in compression and cables in continuous tension that is both light and strong. 3D printers are used to create the model struts. The struts were designed to be hollow so that they could be folded flat for a short period of time. The tubes feature a tiny aperture that runs the length of them. Attachment points at the end of each strut then link these to a network of elastic cables. As a result, the items are flat in their post-printed state. But now you're probably wondering how they got to be four-dimensional. Temperature, of course, has a significant part in this. When the items are submerged in 149 degree Fahrenheit water, they begin to unfurl. Using trial and error, the researchers bake the pace at which this occurs right into the print. This is a crucial phase, since a huge structure that deploys too quickly would result in a big old jumble of cables and rods, which no one wants. So when they printed, they devised a method that enabled them to incorporate this memory, which is responsible for the unfolding pace, in the struts. This also allows the structures to revert to their previous condition. When subjected to a change in heat or temperature, thermoresponsive materials act on the shape memory effect. Alloys, polymers, Hybrids, ceramics, and gels are all possibilities. With these properties, the system is perfect for SpaceX's usage because it unites strength with very little weight and space consumption. This can be a huge benefit to Mr. Musk's endeavor. Musk's Falcon Heavy Starships would be able to carry numerous big structures because of this technology, and Musk is ready to have talks with the Georgia Tech researchers and is willing to incorporate them into SpaceX projects. We are also excited because the dream of Mars that Elon Musk has shown us is probably going to be a reality due to this insane invention. So let's hope for the best. On that note, that's it for today's video. If you're interested in watching more videos on Elon Musk, then what are you waiting for? Simply click the subscribe button and ring the bell icon because new videos are on the way.